What's up, worship boy Iconic? Back again with another video. And yes, I know I'm looking the same, man. I know you think, I know you're thinking to yourself, damn, bro, you got my same clothes. Yes, I do. Um, it's still Friday, it's March 20th, <laughs> Friday, March 20th. Um, and what's going on is that I know I'm gonna be busy tomorrow, which is Saturday. Um, so I wanna go ahead and give y'all a double upload again. Sorry to all of my real fans, real subscribers, real people that follow me and watch my work. Sorry for the long, long, long uh, separation from YouTube. Again, bro, this busy with photography, working with all this virus thing going on, man. Um, I've just been busy trying to keep everything balanced, take care of the family, make sure everything's in line. But since I've been away, I have another unboxing. Um, if you had it, man, go check out my unboxing on the 2020 Up Tempo Nike Air Up Tempo um, that I hit on the sneakers app on the shop drop. Here's my knife. Go ahead and open this joint up. And you should know by the title already what it is. You've probably already seen a million reviews of it, but we just got our pair in um, today. Well, last night actually. About the time I actually got it, it was too late to actually review it. I had to get ready for work in the morning. Before I throw the box, my brother did win this from Premier. So here you go right here. This is the actual box label directly from Premier. If you don't know about Premier, Premier is like a, almost like a, oh, like a journeys for like skateboarders online, like for Nikes and decks and skateboarder gear, uh, Nike SB, stuff of that nature. Um, dope shop, um, we've worn stuff over there before, but you know, that's where we got them from, and I'm done talking about it. They didn't put a receipt in there, man. People are getting real disrespectful by not putting a receipt in these, in these uh, shoe boxes, bruh. But, boom, we have it here, another Nike box, but this time, it's that kind of like emerald color, or whatever you want to call it. They came in this box. Nike SB do better, bro. I know y'all probably already produce these, but I don't like these soft, soft boxes, man. Coat these, make these thick, make them uh, pause. Uh, coat these, make them stronger and um, more durable in the long run. These type of boxes will break, even if you don't have anything in it and you keep stacking boxes on it. It's so thin that it'll you know, fall apart. But anyway, y'all here for that. It is a Nike SB, as you can see. Nike SB right in right there. Um, tag label reads, Nike SB Low Pro ISO. Um, colorway on this joint is neutral gray. Kumquat? Kumquat? I think. Kumquat? Uh, Gris, neutral, orange, and Tennessee. That's what it says. Um, retail on this joint is 90. Resale is up there, man, surprisingly. Shout out to all the people that didn't like Jordan Lowe's and all this stuff. Now all this stuff, Nike SBs are hot. But, another story for another day. Um, size 11 and a half, not my personal pair. Um, I actually can get these from my brother, Lucky. Shout out to him, he did hit for these. But, I'm chilling, bro. Um, anyway, here's the box label right here for any legit checks out there. Uh, here, here's the box label for anybody that's trying to legit check out there at all. Put that right there, 11 and a half size. So it's 11 and a half, price tag $90. I'm going to flip the lid. Huh, Premier sent a sticker right here, as you can see, also from Premier, but no receipt, which makes no sense, but I guess they're trying to be paperless, so I can't be mad at that, but. We get into the shoes. Here's the actual uh, shoe paper right here. This is that tan paper. A lot of you people need this, who bought up all the damn toilet tissue out there during all this bullshit. Take this to wipe your <laughs> Anyway, oh, here it is. Call out the address. Here is the receipt. We are receipt boys. My bad, Premier. We do have a receipt here. Boom, we have it here. The Nike SB Dunk Low in a Safari colorway. Anyway, fire, 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 fire shoe. Um, just looking at it, man, I love how it looks. Um, very unique. Um, Definitely a dope shoe, man. Let's go ahead and get straight into the review, bruh. I'm gonna get straight into the review, bruh. As the bottom, as you can see, man, has that gum sole with that nice forest green hit right in the middle. 
you already know what it say right there. You got your Nike SB down there, which is super, super fire. I like that. I like that a lot. I like the gum sole on this joint. It means it's gonna last longer than normal. Um, you go to the midsole. Now the midsole itself, it's not off-white at all. It's more of like a cream or tan colorway. Um, this is definitely not yellowing or getting dirty anytime soon and if it does look dirty or gets dirty it will add character to it that's just in my opinion uh, you work your way to the upper man and your upper is just like your standard materials uh, i don't feel anything too crazy um i don't know what type of print is this, this is from this sneaker um i've i won't say giraffe or semen print i, I couldn't really tell you but it's some type of animal print on this joint all the way around it is kind of like a gray. It's like two shades of gray almost, like a like a smoke gray and then another light lighter gray. Anyway, um, uh, my bad. Tobot's got this kind of soft material. I can't explain what it is. Um, it's canvas, canvas uh, toe box right there. Very dope. Very dope. Oh, side panels have some nice suede. Okay, I might be I might be talking too fast, man. Side panel has some nice little suede on it, which is dope. Which is dope on the um, medial side. You have your orange swoosh. Um, I'm sorry. On the lateral side, you have your orange swoosh. On the medial side, you have your green swoosh. Me personally, I think if the green swoosh was on the outside, this would have made it doper. Um, I feel like it looks with the orange on the outside. I think it just blends, uh, kind of blends all in. I like that kind of contrast. You see how that is, that contrast there? Or if they would have did it, they should have did like one orange on this side and one green on that side. I don't know what they be having going on. Um, but again, nice little suede or new buck that's on the side panels on the uh, lateral side and the medial side. Um, as you get into the sock line, the same old sock line. Nothing crazy about that. You got your hit of brown right here on the end, which is dope. And then you got that green swoosh on the tongue. You have your Nike on the tongue right there. Man, that light is terrible. On the tongue right there, you do have your Nike SB. You got the uh, green uh, layout, and then you got your orange swoosh Nike, and then your SB right there. Um, it did come with these kind of golden laces right here. Um, didn't see anything else than that. But these laces, um, again, I, this shoe is okay. I think they're going for 300, bro. I don't think I personally would pay 300 for it, but you know, to each his own. I've been there. Some people want to pay the prices I pay for certain shoes. Um, right here, you have another swoosh. I think that's a little dope touch to it as well. That's also in some type of either like smoke gray. Bob two, you got your black laces and black tongue. Um, nothing too much crazy going on about this. Um, for shoes like this, bro, just cause it's like dope, we're gonna be limited. And since a lot of stuff is only being released on the skate shops, they need to start making special boxes for these joints. So just making it, you know, cooler, you know what I mean? Some some type of face or fashion for the folks that's into that type of stuff. Same old insole right here. Always love that Zoom Air insole. You do have that Nike, um, Nike SD right there. And you have the zoom air. Let me flip that back right. You have your zoom air right there. Hopefully, hopefully. Got your zoom air right there, then your Nike SB right here with the green swoosh, green writing. Uh, production dates on this joint is 04-16-2019 to September 13, 2019. This is how the inside looks right here. Again, um, if anything, these type of shoes will be getting faked the most because they're the most hyped. Uh, with all the virus stuff going on, I don't know if they're even doing fakes, but you always want to be careful, man. You never know. You never know. But overall, man, I think it's a dope shoe. Here's the tissue paper that was inside the shoe. I think it's a dope shoe. Um, if I was to get this for retail, I would would have kept. But um, I don't. I'm not. I'm not a fan of paying retail right now. I'm just trying to enjoy shoes like what I like. It's not about always getting the hype stuff like this. Again, this is dope, but you know, it, it is what it is at this point with sneakers, you know what I mean? I am on a bigger mission. That's why you haven't seen me as much, but trust me, trust me, trust me. A lot of heat is gonna continue to come on the channel. You know, I always try to bring the bangers, try to keep y'all, you know, some type, somewhat entertained, bro. But again, I got a lot going on 
in a good way though, not a bad way. I got a lot going on in a good way. And trust me, in the long run, it's gonna be worth it, man. Just stay tuned to the channel. Y'all make sure y'all keep, um, keep supporting, keep hitting that like button, keep hitting that subscribe button, and also hitting that notification bell to stay in tune with what I got going on. You know how it goes down over here in my channel. The future belongs to those who prepare today. Let me know what y'all think, man. Is this heat? Is it worth the resale? It's, it's all right, but I don't, I don't think it's worth the resale. It's okay. I think it's all right, but I don't think it's worth the resale, y'all. I don't think I, I don't think it's worth the resale, but y'all let me know. Is it worth the resale or not? And I'm out.